I'm honoured that you have chosen me to be the leader of Pontypandy's first Neighbourhood Watch Committee. That's strange. I don't remember choosing a leader. Maybe that was the day we were abducted by aliens. Or maybe we all bumped our heads and lost <laughs> our memories. <clears throat> My vision is to make Pontypandy the safest neighbourhood in Wales. We shall all help make Pontypandy free from crime and look after each other. If you ask me, it's about time. Sweets go missing from the shop every day. Just last week, my licorice all sorts vanished without a trace. <laughs> my firefighters have agreed to join the Neighbourhood Watch scheme. I now call on everyone to do the same. Great! Let's start our very own Neighbourhood Watch scheme. We'll help people in trouble. Yes, just like the Pontypandy firefighters. Let's tell Uncle Sam. Come on. Well... Uncle Sam... We're going to start our very own Neighbourhood Watch. Good idea. Yes, indeed. I knew my speech would inspire the young people. So you don't mind if we use the garden shed at the fire station as our headquarters? Hmm. Very well. Operation... Crisis! Enter! Wow! What's all this for? It's so we can make sure everyone is safe. Just like Fireman Sam! You can see all the way to Pontypandy Mountain! Oh look! There's Elvis dancing! There's Bella hanging up her washing. There's Norman. Ah! Uh, hmm... Interesting. What is it? There's someone suspicious outside Dillis's store. Are you sure? It all looks a bit blurry to me. Trust me, I have a feeling for this kind of thing. Oh, no! He's stealing the fruit! We'd better call the police. No need. We're the Junior Neighbourhood Watch and we can do it on our own. Let's go before he gets away. I'll need a volunteer for this exercise. Someone to climb to the roof and pretend to be in trouble. I'll do it, sir. I'll be on that roof before you can say a wop bop a loop bop a loop ba boom Very well, Officer Cridlington. Remember to wear the safety harness, just in case. Sam, I want you to beat your current time of two minutes, 20 seconds. Ready? Huh? Go. Huh? Hang on, I'm not ready yet. He's taken a whole crate of Dillis' fruit. We can't let him get away with it. I'm going to get my dad. And we saw him stealing fruit. We'll soon put a stop to that. But, Dad, that's Bella's tablecloth. You can't take that. I'm only borrowing it. <laughs> Quick, kids, give me a hand. Uh, 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 <gasps> that's me. What's all this commotion? No need to panic, Dillis. Everything's under control. We caught this criminal stealing your fruit. Oh. Trevor uh. Evans, what on earth? I wasn't stealing the fruit. I was taking it to deliver to Dillis's customers. Are you all right? Well, I have felt better. Come inside and I'll put some ice on that nasty bum. You really ought to check your facts before jumping to conclusions, Mandy. You think people will be pleased that we're trying to help? <laughs> I'm going to fall! Well, not really, like. Extend the Simon Snorkel. Penny, there's something wrong with the snorkel. The switch is down as far as it'll go. Great fires of London. I think it's stuck. <whistles> Abort exercise! Abort exercise! Officer Cridlington, you'll have to come down using the safety harness. Righty ho Looks like we'll have to book Jupiter in for a refit. Mm, excellent homemade sauce. Mm, oh, Mamma mia, it's tight. Oh. Oh. <gasps> Quick, there's been an accident. Bella's covered in blood. We'd better call an ambulance. No, no need for that. 
My mum's a nurse, remember? I know everything about first aid. <gasps> lie her down. Hey, what are you doing? Just lie down, Bella. We've got to <gasps> stop the bleeding. Bandages, bandages. Use the tablecloth. <gasps> but... Oh. Don't try to talk, Bella. Save your energy. Mamma mia. Phew. Looks like she's going to be okay. Good work, team. <laughs> That's not blood. It's tomato sauce. Whoops. Some people are so ungrateful. Oh. Hey, that's my dad's ladder. I wonder what it's doing here. Etty's forgotten it. Oh, we can't leave it here. It's far too dangerous. Down a bit. Steady. Oh. <sighs> oh. Oi, where's my ladder gone? Dad, oh. what are you doing up there? I was fixing Bella's roof. Is this your doing again, Mandy? Not exactly. We'd better call Fireman Sam. No, I'm fine. I can get down on my own. Dad, no! Ah! Mike Flood's in trouble. He's stuck on a roof. But Jupiter Snorkel doesn't work. Never mind about that. Let's get a move on. Thank goodness, here comes Fireman Sam. Oh! Don't worry, Mike. We'll have you down in no time. But, Sam, what are we going to do? The Simon ah. Snorkel isn't working. Let's try and see how far it'll reach. Oh. I still can't quite get him. Oh. Ah. Oh, great fires of London. The levers come unstuck. Oh, dear. Ah. Oh. Oh. Okay, Mike. Oh, I felt better. Sorry, Dad. I just wanted to help. I thought your ladder might cause an accident. Well, there's no harm done. Thanks to Fireman Sam. I couldn't have done it without Penny and Elvis. Remember, Mandy, there are some jobs you just have to leave to the experts. You're right, I'll do that from now on. Oh! Has anyone lost a ladder? <laughs> 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 <laughs>